guys in this one I'm going to show you how to add a really quick snow overlay so all I did was I went to Photoshop and I hit open I found my photo now I had already edited this photo so I just want to add a snow overlay I went over to Google I typed in transparent snow overlay and I picked one that some of the snow was kind of blurred out so I'm gonna go file place embedded file place embedded now we have this it is a smart object First, what we want to do is we want to select the different filter options for this and just see if we can get it to um, lighten or see right here. We got it. And all we did was we went select here, go up here, and we're going to go to lighten or screen. I think screen looks great, but for this one, we're going to use lighten. Now, I'm going to stretch this over the photo to complete it. Now, if I wanted to blur this out some more, okay, I would select this layer. I would go up here to filter. I would go to blur and Gaussian blur. And then I could decide if I wanted to see if I wanted more blur, less blur, right? So we'll just add just a little bit more blur to it. There we go. That's fine. And now we want to select this layer and grab our eraser, eraser tool. And we want to go ahead and make this hardness zero, make the size a little bigger here. And rasterize layer, if it doesn't allow you, you can right click and go to rasterize layer. But now we have the ability to take off some of the snowflakes that are drowning out the image a little bit here. So this one was in front of the eye, that wasn't looking good. This is in front of her eyelash. Kind of get the ones off of her face, get the ones that look a little too gray, right? And now you have a really amazing picture with a snow overlay. Now, all you have to do is go file and export, export as, and then figure out your file size. And this image is done. Now, I did pre-edit the photo itself. I, this is just to get a really good snow image there. And I think PNG is fine. And this image is fine. If you wanted to change that, you could select, make it smaller, or you could make it larger. PNG just stands for Portable Network Graphic, uh, meaning it doesn't compress when it's sent over um, the internet. So anyways, I would hit export, and then you have a really awesome profile picture with a snow overlay. Now to toggle this on and off, look at that. And we could even get picky and go back in here and delete some of this, like erase that right there. See, before, after. And for more help in tutorials like this, go to basictheboss.com if you need help with your business for the year. Later, guys.